Since we launched our historic infrastructure plan, which will invest more than $180 billion in communities across the country, our government has approved thousands of projects, big and small, from everything from highways to community centres. This month, I'm visiting some of those sites where new infrastructure is making a real difference, creating good jobs for the middle class, building the healthy communities Canadians deserve, and helping our businesses thrive. And today, we're celebrating a new investment right here in your backyard. But first, let me take a moment to remember Winnipeg bus driver Irvin Jubal Fraser, who was tragically killed on the job two years ago this coming Valentine's Day. Jubal, or Superman to his colleagues, was always helping others, a true example of how each and every one of us can make a real difference. J'ai l'honneur d'ailleurs d'avoir dans mon équipe un ancien chauffeur d'autobus, le ministre Amarjit Sohi. Et je peux vous assurer que, à chaque jour, ceux qui opèrent nos réseaux de transport en commun font de notre pays un meilleur endroit. C'est donc pourquoi notre gouvernement investit pour qu'ils aient les outils dont ils ont besoin pour continuer leur excellent travail. Today, I can announce that the federal government is investing in upgrades to the Winnipeg transit maintenance and repair facilities to keep this city's buses in top shape. Whether it's renovations for the maintenance garage or upgrades for the shop's equipment, we're investing so that Winnipeggers can count on a quick and reliable trip. Because although people riding the bus won't see the new hoists or the new ultrasonic cleaner in the repair shop, what they will see is good service when they're traveling to work or to events like the Festival du Voyageur, something I know folks here are looking forward to this weekend. That's what people need, and that's what communities need. Efficient transit that's affordable, convenient, and keeps our air clean. And just like other infrastructure projects that we're delivering across Canada, we know that when different orders of government work together, we can achieve even better results. That's why this federal investment of two and a half million dollars in the Winnipeg transit system is done in partnership with the city of Winnipeg. L'annonce d'aujourd'hui est un autre exemple des investissements que nous réalisons pour répondre aux besoins de Winnipeg pour qu'elle demeure un endroit fantastique où vivre, travailler et fonder une famille. 